Hey guys, it's Sam. Uh, Wednesday, Three Awesome Geeks. I'm really sorry again about the uh, the another quick capture video, but I'm kind of pressed for time. It's uh, as I record this, it's 10 to 10. I need to get up at 6 o'clock in the morning, and I have more work to do and stuff that I want slash need to get done. So I'm gonna try and make this quick. Um, uh, real quick before I forget uh, to whore myself out again, uh, I am going to be on the radio. Uh, from 7 o'clock in the morning to 10 o'clock in the morning uh, tomorrow. That's Thursday, every Thursday, in fact, from 7 to 10. Um, on, I'll put a link off to the side. It's whrwfm.org. Uh, so, yeah, tune in. I have good music to play for you. So what's been going on this week? I'm glad that you asked through your computer screen. Um, I've been reading... Uh, read Madman Atomic Comics Volume One. Uh, it's it's quite good, um, but it's going to make absolutely no sense if you uh, haven't been reading Madman or haven't read at least any of it, um, or most of it beforehand. Uh, there's a pretty good recap in the beginning, but it's really not enough to know to clue you in on what's been going on. So. Uh, you really need to read the archives, and then once you have a uh, feel for the cast, then then you should check it out because it'll blow your fool mind. Uh, Union Station. I can't remember. Uh, Ande Parks and Eduardo Barreto. Uh, Barreto does great art. Uh, Parks does some pretty decent writing too, as well. Uh, Union Station is actually about the Union Station massacre, which helped get the FBI really made the FBI what it is today in terms of funding and power and influence and jurisdiction. Um, it's it's a monster now, but it, it tells the story of how it got that way, because the FBI used to be this little dinky thing. And uh, great, great historical fiction. I really uh, I would recommend that. And read The Ultimates. This is Pile Alex's hardcover copy. Uh, the Ultimate, I reread it. Because it's a good comic book, but we're also reviewing it this week on the Mild Mattered Podcast, which you can listen to at any point in time on iTunes, or you can go to the to mildmanneredpodcast.com, or you can do both. That's the magic of the interwebs. Uh, yeah, we'll be reviewing that and with our special guest, Aaron Gold, uh, who, is a, who is a funny and clever and oftentimes insightful human being. So that'll be a great deal of fun. You should tune in and check that out. Um, and I'm going to sign off now. Once again, I'm sorry for the awful audio quality and the awful video quality and the really rushed video and everything, but I still love you guys. And thank you for watching. I've been Sam. This has been 3 Awesome Geeks, and we'll see you next time.